Hi everyone. Now we are going to discuss about the important synthetic tool that is width reduction. So what is this width reduction? Let us see. So it is the partial reduction of aromatic Normally you will see uh, reduction means it will be completely reduced and it will be converted to hydrogen. But uh, here there is a partial reduction of aromatic compound such as benzene. So here we will see the reduction of benzene which will be converted into one fourth dihydride one first question and fourth question hydrogen will be added there. So it will be converted to one fourth dihydrocyclohexadiene. This reaction, this benzene will be converted into there is a partial reduction, so it will be converted into cyclohexadiene. So this reaction will be carried out in presence of sodium and lithium. Uh, this sodium and lithium will be present in ammonia. And uh, this reaction will be carried out in presence of alcohol. So HR the aromatic compound will be converted uh, partial reduction of that aromatic compound into one four dihydro cyclo hexadiene. So this reaction will be carried down in presence of sodium and lithium in ammonia and alcohol. What is the mechanism behind this reaction? It involves four steps. The first step, there will be uh, attack of the electron. This uh, electron will be provided by the sodium and lithium. So it will give this intermediate. So one electron will be attacked. So it will give this intermediate. This intermediate, that is, uh, this intermediate is further protonated. The alcohol that is present in that uh, solution will give the proton. So it will be converted into this CH2. So CH is present here. It will be converted into CH. So the second intermediate compound will be formed uh, by means of protonation. This protonation will be carried down by this alcohol. So the protonated derivative will be further attacked by electron. This electron is provided by the sodium lithium metal. So it will give the uh, this intermediate. So it will be become the Cation will be formed here, sorry, carbonyl will be formed here. This further attack by proton, that is uh, electron attack followed by the protonation. This protonation is carried down by this alcohol. That alcohol will be uh, the final product, that is uh, two hydrogen will be added. So it will be converted to CH2 and in the first question and as well as fourth question. Hydrogen will be added, so it will give the end product. So this uh, involves the four steps. First step one is the uh, attack of the electron to give the intermediate compound, and the second one to give the intermediate next intermediate compound. It will be protonated. This protonation will be carried down by the alcohol, followed by further attack of the electron. It will be further attacked by the electron. So it will give the intermediate three. This intermediate, that is carbonyl, will be formed. This carbonyl is further protonated. This reaction will be carried down, that is protonation will be carried down by the alcohol to give the final product, that is 1 4 uh, dihydrocyclohexadiene will be formed. Let us see the recap of this reaction. So what is uh, bridge reduction? As we know very well, it is the partial reduction of aromatic compound. So this is not normal reduction reaction. It is just a partial reduction. So it will be converted into one four dihydrocyclohexadiene. This reaction will be carried out in presence of sodium and lithium. Any metal will be uh, present. That is so either sodium or lithium will be present. That will be present in ammonia. And this reaction will be carried down in presence of alcohol. So, this is the uh, definition for that is the partial reduction of aromatic compound into 1 4 dihydro cyclohexadiene. This reaction will be carried down in presence of sodium or lithium in ammonia and in presence of alcohol. It involves four steps. That is, the first step will be attack of the electron to be the intermediate one, 
first step proton mixer, second step, then again attack of electron, followed by proton mixer, will give the final product, one for dihydrocycla hexadiene. This is the uh, mechanism behind this one. The, what is the application of this uh, virtue reduction? It is an important uh, reaction. In so many reactions, this uh, mechanism will be involved. So it is useful for the partial reduction of aromatic compounds. That is, it should contain a benzenoid nucleus. This is very important. The compound which is uh, having the benzenoid reaction uh, compound will be converted into this partial reduction will be carried out by means of this bit reduction. I hope you could understand this mechanism and its applications. Thank you.